Hello, my name is Abe, and welcome back to Vagante, new game. I've been enjoying these, I've been enjoying the random runs of just getting a completely random character with a random background. I just wish that I could see this when I am uh, in the game. I can't see the whole description, like the green indicator, uh, the, the text. I don't actually see this when I'm in the run. So for instance, we've had Cursed Adherent. I didn't see that the ability from this was greatly increased chance of cursed items from chests. Acolyte of the Light can heal. Acolyte of Chaos is random. Faithless Heathen gains stats from destroying shrines. Very unlucky. We did that one. Uh, it was very interesting. Every shrine has its own unique negative associated with it. And then one that's locked, but I think this is just like you're on one HP the whole run. Scholar. Sacrifices to the Scholar are more rewarding. Bonfires have a chance to grant stacking bonuses to equipped items until unequipped. Okay. Bloody Adherent. Heal in combat when low on health. Mimic Whisper. Boomerang. You get a boomerang. Nimble. Reduced fall damage. Armored. Item. Potion Addict. Plus four when drinking any potion. Stoic. Status effect duration lower and reduced knockback. Grappling Hook. Poison Resistance. Poison Potions heal you. Increased stats for each floor beaten without equipment. Breaking the Vow is permanent. That's Ascetic. Farsighted is better light. Wanted is ring, but shopkeepers attack. Raised by the merchant. More gold and discounts. Heavy throws is strong. Experience is starting luck. Bookworm is plus one spell book starting level. That's very good. If you get like a summon monster, it's immediately level two in summoning imps. Survivor, bonfire healing, illiterate, bombs, helmet, cannot read scrolls or books. At least now I've read them all. Maybe I'll actually be able to remember what they all do. Let's jump into a run. We are uh, starting off as a base mage so we have eloquence let's do it taco sunday says what did noita do to you abe noita is far too unstable for me to want to play it right now <laughs> i've got to be honest okay magic rod that's our weapon we s whoa we start with frost nova what hold on Survivor. Years of living in the harsh wildlife have left you with impressive survival skills. We have 10 intelligence. I don't know what survive. I don't even remember what Survivor was. <laughs> we have we have Frost Nova, which is very surprising. Guys, what was Survivor? I've already forgotten. Uh, Book of Shockwave. We're just going to read this, I think. Now we have three spells, and they're all, like, really freaking good. Archery. Holy. Alchemy. Animal. I do love one point in uh, alchemy. I also really like animals. We might go animal, save potions, then go alchemy later. Sounds good to me. We don't have a lot of health, but we have ten intelligence, so we're going to go definitely into uh, spells. Although we don't have access to rod, so the rod is just rod. Okay, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling good. Abe, hey, but Noita loves you, please come back, it'll be different this time, Noita swears. It's not even that I want it to be different, it's just a buggy mess that crashes all the time, and I'm just, I just don't have fun playing it after, like, an hour. <laughs> Better bonfire healing, ah, okay, yes. That's actually pretty nice. I can accept that. I can accept a better bonfire healing. That actually seems like a pretty nice ability to have. In general. Dun, 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 dun. Set up a pole. How will Abe die? I don't know. Can Mud do that? He could do it. If he can't do it. Maybe he can do it now. We have gloves. Wall phasing plus one speed, okay. I should make someone else a mod and then they can set up poles that I don't have to constantly ask Mud to do it. Mage best character spells OP. That's probably why we started with Frost Nova, isn't it? Circle of Light is really good for multiplayer. I've actually, uh, I've seen that Circle of Light um, doesn't actually do anything. Uh, in single player. It doesn't heal 
your uh, like familiars at all. So Circle of Light, if you started with that as your random bonus, you might as well just restart because you're you're not getting you're not gaining anything. Hold on. Let me let me deal with these slimes first, my friend. Whoa, dude, be careful, slimes. All right, bomb and grotesque fighter's glove. We're not even gonna be able to afford any of those. No reason to bother. Dude, it's actually hilarious to see how much of a difference it is to be able to see. <laughs> Cause the last run, what is this in the corner? Get out of here, rat. The last run, I couldn't see anything and it was kind of funny because I had taken the, well, I randomed into destroy shrines, and when you destroy shrines of the light, you lose literal light. It was a lot of fun. I now know never to destroy those shrines, though, in the future. Well, my rod didn't save me. So, uh, like, the rod seems to have a hard time hitting the slimes. It, it attacks through them. Oh! Dexterity luck. Now, I, I gotta be honest, uh, I am kind of interested in maybe going bow build instead of animal build early. But the animal build, I don't think it's a, like associated with my weapon damage, which is a rod. So I think we could take that and then actually still utilize uh, animal as a decent way of doing damage, as an attack. Flame aura plus one intelligence. Dude, our intelligence is absurd. I'm gonna imagine Frost Nova might be pretty good against a sleeping dragon. Okay, well, I am on fire now. My dude does very easily uh, get around that though. Oh my God, he hit him for 20. Hey, come here. Whoa, don't burn me. Don't burn me. Don't burn me. Charge it up. Okay, that time it didn't do any damage. <laughs> this isn't working as well as I expected. I guess Eloquence does crit for, uh, for seven. Okay. There you go, and mud set up a pull. Thank you for that mud. given the, the chat what they want. Death roulette. We're not going down there. Okay. We took some damage, but we will heal this. This is a Shrine of the Scholar, right? No, this is deranged. Um, I don't really want to give the deranged anything. We're gonna skip him. We're gonna go open the chest. Get a sword. I mean, it's better than a freaking rod, I think. Shocking, plus one speed, plus two intelligence, even just the plus intelligence. Like, if I'm gonna roll intelligence, you might as well roll intelligence, right? Stop hurting the local wildlife. That dragon, A, wanted to kill me first, and B, stood in the way of me getting a level up. Also, I did see that we healed for an extra five. That's actually, you know, that could matter over the course of a run, sure. Animals really good to get on Bear Stomp. Archery is also like exceptional, exceptional. And Holy is good too. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I, in theory, we can get literally everything, but only just if we go Animal 2. Alchemy one, holy four, archery five. I wouldn't mind getting uh, holy because you do get negate fatal damage once per floor and then swinging your weapon gives you holy light. That's actually like a pretty solid damage bonus. Let's go there. Because we have 60 health, let's try to get to negate fatal damage.
It's damp in here. Well, maybe not yet, but it will get damp. I don't know what the point of is this, uh, uh, of this little hallway here. It's just spikes. It's like, hey, you wanted a secret? Fine, mother trucker. Here's your secret. Not much of a secret, more like, hey, spikes. Damage to gold could be okay. I bet 50 that Abe, Abe, that Abe guy gets squashed. Hopefully not, but you never know. I mean, you know, actually, I think, I think I would like to get the ability to, like, take a hit and then survive. But I actually think that eloquence is, did I burn you? Oh, it was my armor. I think that we have 10 intelligence. Let's be honest. We are going to roll a mage build. We need to get spells. Now, I don't really have any damaging spells other than Shockwave, but we can get some. It's just an infinite use... Oh, another rod. It's just an infinite use ranged attack. Spirit emitter. Oh, well, it's something. Sorry, rat friend. I mean, I'm two-shotting the bandits with my ten intelligence here. That's fantastic. It, yeah, you, you know what? I like this. I like this because we also have no dexterity. Our dexterity stat is three, so our bow's not really going to be doing that much damage. It's this is this is really a mage build through and through. I'm incredibly glad to have picked up magic missile. It's a very good spell. In fact, I'm going to take these off the hot bar, so it's just a quick swap between the two of them. Five damage magic missiles! I've never seen that much damage out of magic missile before. I'm I'm a hundred percent honest with you. That guy went through the block, and so he can't actually like get over here anymore. <laughs> This is a very, like, awkward way to fight this guy, but, like, it'll work, right? Another 19 damage. <laughs> I like that. Hey, come here. I guess my shots can't hit the wall. Dude, our damage is freaking absurd right now. I've, n I've never had a, ma a major on this strong, with the exception, of course, of being uh, Summon Monster. Summon Monster has always been a fantastic spell, but you've got to luck into it. I've never had magic missiles doing five before. Usually they're like two or three. Oh, 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 oh baby. I int magic missiles OP comedian says, especially with high levels on it, you get like 40 plus casts at 20 int. That's what I'm thinking. Like, we have uh, 20 cast, 25 cast by default. That's fantastic. So I want to see if this will activate the trap. It does. That makes sense. I mean, it's a giant shockwave after all. Um, there's nothing down there, though. I do have to find the exit, and then we got to go back for the ferry, of course. It's, it's almost a shame did you see that? Oh, it's the water. It's almost a sh Why is it dripping from the sky? That just looks weird. It's almost a shame that we uh, don't have better mage-related uh, skills to unlock. Like, I would love to have a wand build with this. Or, sorry, a rod build. Or a wand build, but wands, uh, I guess, don't quite synergize like you would want them to. Found the exit. There was nothing in the shop that we wanted, so we are out of here. We've got the key. Water just, I guess it just sometimes drips from the sky as well, because it is, it is dripping. Dun, dun. 
found the exit and the ferry unless you're talking about exit two. Oh, I am definitely talking about exit two, electric boogaloo. Dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna grab the rat. Still at full health, which is beautiful. Uh, this way. Maximum health is low, but let's not worry about that right now. Let's not let me go through the door. Generic welcome. Yeah, I know that um, it's damp in here makes the cave slowly fill up with water. I was just weirded out that it fell from the sky. Normally it just drips out through the door, but it looked like it was going through the, the ceiling. I don't think I've ever seen that before. It was weird. Swinging your weapon, negate fatal damage. You know, I, I think I'm gonna put a point in alchemy, but we, we don't need this as much as I thought we would. We still have holy no fall damage, but we don't really need Swinging your weapon manifests holy light. I'm not using my weapon. I'm going to be using spells. Let's get alchemy so we get all potions. And if we get potions of int, perfect. Boom. Done. Potion of regen. Boom. Done. Potion of lower intelligence. Maybe not that one, but... Vigor. We'll keep that one around. Like, getting... Um, getting... Uh, Alchemy level one, it's so, so good. It's so handy just to have everything identified for you. Freezing and strength, speed and plus two intelligence, definitely select that one. Plus one speed, nope. So we've got a sword, a hood, some gloves, secondary weapon. We've got a bow, we've got some arrows. Uh, garbage we don't want, garbage we don't want, some scrolls, which are fine. Okay, we're good to go. Wild Royd, welcome as well, how are you doing today? The Ruins, aka uh, accidentally hit a teleporter and then lose track of where you're supposed to be in the level. I like that the order that you put the spells on, like the order you activate them, is the order you cycle through them. So right now it's Eloquence into Magic Missile, which I think is what I want. So I can do it ideally quickly. It's a book. Flame Pillar. We have to think. If we find a spell book that we're probably not going to use, Oh, that's a nasty amount of burn damage to have happen right there. If we find a spell book that we're not going to use, we might want to consider saving it. Just kill him like this. Uh, and then if we save it, we can swap it later for a different spell book. You know, I have a bow. Nope. Not how that works. Sorry, I am. Uh, I didn't mean bow. Did I say bow? If we find a spellbook we don't want, we can save it, recycle it later from a, a scholar, and then maybe get a different spellbook out of it, like a different spell. That could be good to do. Sorry, this is just like I'm trying to think about how I want to handle this right now. There's a lot going on. Should really just be using the bow for them. Save the spells, you're going to need them. We have bosses coming up. Maybe, there you go, maybe use one and then switch to something else, potentially. Wall phasing minus two poison resist. Okay, uh, I mean, I literally have better. Pushing a feather fall. Let's keep that here and keep that here in like the utility slot. Potions. Got some scrolls, flame pillar. I don't know if I want flame pillar. Plus one speed on an amulet. Book of Shockwave. We have Shockwave, so a second Shockwave I think I'll, I'll read. Not only do we get more charges from it, but it is a better spell now. Sounds good to me. It's 
finish exploring. Ah, good. I like being able to make it up here, because it means we should be able to find some corpses. Yeah, from you in particular. And I can use you to activate some traps. This is a very like weird layout. I've never seen a, a layout quite like this before. It looped back and then came back down to the bottom level. But here's what I'm thinking. You go here. <laughs> you don't know where it went, but maybe you'll find it later. First time seeing this game, it looks cool. I don't know why, but the graphic style looks familiar. This is a... Uh, it's a bit of an older roguelite, but it checks out, and it is lovely and wonderful, and I, I enjoy it, and it's so nice. Lightning resistance will take it. A very, very solid game. Okay. See you later. Again, maybe we'll find you one day, maybe we won't. Would like to get up there, because there's almost certainly gonna be like loot. But he looks so surprised when I kill him. <laughs> um we're probably not gonna be able to get up there though. There you go. Just kinda making my way back and making sure all the traps are disabled so that you know we don't accidentally screw ourselves. I guess maybe one of the teleporters could have brought us up there. I gotta remember that th there's a, a teleport that looks like it is burning. That's the one that actually burns you, ironically enough. Sorry, just taking a drink. Got some coffee here, keeps me going. I think we're ready. I hope Magic Missile can just <laughs> ice this guy. Oh, get out. He's trying. Oh my god. Dude, <laughs> Magic Missile is absurd against this guy. He can't do anything. Oh! Move! <laughs> you get locked in place for so... I mean, it's ironic that I said that right before I got freaking owned. But my god, when you get iced by this guy, you get locked in place for so long. Luckily, he doesn't do that much damage, but that's annoying. Okay, we did it. We got through it, everybody. Open the chest. Luck, regen, and clogs. Please give me like a high jump. Do double jump? Um, okay, we gotta kill you. It's a freebie chest. The woodsman's axe. Not good enough. Okay. Well, we are done. We are ready to go. We picked up a potion of luck. Let's drink that. We have a second potion of regen. A lot of junk in my inventory I can't use. You know what I would like? I would like to get a scroll of jump. So I'm gonna I'm gonna walk over here. Scroll of teleport. Ironically, put me right in the position that. Allowed, would allow me to open up that chest. Connie, welcome. How are you doing? I've returned from my festival, festival-filled day. Tell us all about it. Magic mapping. I can see all the things I'm missing. Something over there. Uncurse. Probably an enchant or an identify. I mean, dude, these boots are fantastic. Let's upgrade the boots. Let's identify. That's okay. All right, we didn't get a scroll of jump. 
but we can see there's a shrine of the scholar right there and a shrine of the shackled right there. What happens if you break shrine of the bloody? Do you get stats from it? I can't remember. I have double jump. I could have made it. I'm sorry. I'm an idiot and you're absolutely correct. Generic 0815. <laughs> I sh I could have easily made it if I had just jumped. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> oh my god, that's just like... You freaking dummy, of course you can make it! Uh, it's okay, that's okay. Give me animal. And then we can do this. Sorry, do this. And he says, Finland's biggest metal festival. Sounds like a lot of fun, actually. Whoa! Freaking rude, McDude. Actually, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Come here. That kind of worked. Chug that coffee. Maybe we need some more, yeah. Well, there wasn't any good shrines up there, anyway. It's like a shrine of the, um,. The smith would have been beautiful. I have 16 gosh darn intelligence. Good lord. I am a smart man. Wait a minute. A bit scuffed, but a kill is a kill. I mean, you can you can let those things uh, eat you once. And it's usually not a, a huge deal. They, they don't do damage immediately. They do damage only after a second, so you can, you can break free. First orb gives you an int, last one is strength. It's good to know. I, I actually don't know like what stats they give you. I know that they all give you one, but. Hmm. How do we do this? You just walk up to enemies and electrify them. You know, that's a solid plan. Let's go. Book of Ice Ball. That is exceptionally good. 14 ice balls is real nice. Ice ball is real, uh, really good because of, I think, the, like, abomination boss that you get in the catacombs. This is actually, like, a good way of killing him, I think. I've usually had good, uh, good luck with this. Oh, it's plus two intelligence. Oh, that's even better. That's good stats. Also, hey, I have a double jump. I remembered. Yay. Connie says, I would give good money for a foot massage right now. Eight, hour, eight hours of standing does that to you. You can ask Chad. I'm, maybe there's someone in there who's like, yeah, I'm looking, looking to give a foot massage. I'll pay. I know what boss it is. Entire freaking screen is shaking. Slow aura, dexterity luck, boulder protection, dexterity luck. We will be buying boulder protection if we don't get it because boulder protection is freaking necessary later on. Uh, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. He's gonna jump. Yes, I will be killing him entirely with magic missiles because I am a, a weak little mageling. Da, da, da. Oh god! Freaking rude McDude here. Very sorry, uh, Shrine. In that soundtrack, by the way, like the, the jungle boss fight soundtrack, I swear there's a dog barking. It goes Burp. I hope I'm not the only one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bounce for a second. 
I know that there was a shrine of the bloody on the last floor. I, I wish that there was one every floor because I want to I want to trade away my HP. I got HP, but nothing to do with it. Should really just do this. Um, all right, that didn't work. Yeah, that didn't work. You know what, just stick with the plan. He's probably close to death. But you killed the plant, which is just like absolutely wonderful for me. Something else I don't have to deal with, you know what? Nope, 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 nope. He bounced wicked early on this one. Maybe don't go into the water and cast a lightning spell. All right. Easy fight, easy fight. I thought the shopkeeper was mad at me. I was like, excuse me, I didn't do anything. All right, I'm gonna spend the key. Potion of Regen, I'm very glad I spent the key. Potion of Defense, we'll keep it. We've got a lot of loot, some of which we don't need. Damage to gold. <sighs> plus two speed, plus one luck, plus one intelligence. I, I like the plus two intelligence more, but I've got to admit this is also pretty decent, maybe for doing raw damage later. We don't need this rod. I'm not using rods, let's be honest. So let's keep it, but equip this one for now. Demonic Familiar, Dexterity, Vitality, Minus Luck. I mean, it's better than just an amulet of one speed, even though it does lower our luck a little bit. We have a Weightless Potion, and then a Smith. A lot of stuff to dump onto it. Didn't get much out of it though. Another double jump, huh? Flame aura intelligence, flame aura intelligence luck minus one poison resist. Let's keep the keep the current one. Hold on, let me let me compare. It's the same number of stats. They both give fire resist. This one gives more luck and speed, this one gives strength and dexterity. Gotta be honest, I think I want more luck and speed because we're not using strength or dexterity all that much, are we? I have a third pair of boots. Not interested. A wave rod. Dude, a wave rod actually might be worth using. Wave rods are pretty cool. We don't have to use it for the whole run, but like it's a it's a good item to hold on to, I think. All right, give me Boulder Protection. <laughs> we'll hold on to this for a little while. What is this Flame Pillar? Yeah, I don't think we need Flame Pillar. Flame Pillar is not that good. Although I guess maybe it can do a lot of burn damage to certain enemies if you're in their face when you cast it, potentially. Never know. Okay, don't break the shrine. This is deranged. deranged. I mean, I could, I can give you a potion. Take my bad potion. You know, we could, uh, if we really wanted to, we could take a point in alchemy and get randomized potions. Whatever, I think we're out. That one comedian with the spoilers! It's actually not much of a spoiler, but... There are, uh, apparently, Smith recipes, which I didn't know. You don't have to tell me about specific things like that. I probably would never figure it out on my own, but I'm probably not going to utilize it all that much. We want 
bear stomp? I already have a double jump. I think I do want bear stomp as another way of doing damage when I'm out of spells, but after that, maybe we'll just go alchemy and archery. I know we don't have good dexterity either, but I do have, you know, 50 arrows I'm not using. Yeah. I'm also dumb. We need to have... Hold on. Let me, let me look at something. Int 15. Int 16. So you have to have the weapon equipped to actually have it give you stats. Which makes sense. I was just curious if maybe we could um, get more charges for magic missile by switching to the sword. But I should have had it equipped before I left the campfire. can't see the boss on the minimap. That makes me think that maybe it's the um, the weird wisp thing, but who knows. Book of Lightning! Dude, we're getting such good spells. <laughs> okay, let me, let me order these. Eloquence, Magic Missile. Lightning, Shock, Ice. Eloquence, Magic Missile, Lightning, Shock, Ice. It's not Shock, it's something else completely, but... Dun, dun, dun. Link Dagger is just funny to make enemies randomly teleport away from you. That sounds like a, uh, something the Deranged would say. It's worth it. I, s I saved you! I saved you and you're going to try to kill me? Again, I saved you. Be my friend. They should get charmed if you save them from a plant. And then be yours for the remainder of the level. It only ma It's only fair. All that luck is paying off. All my three luck. Oh, hold on. I mean, if I can if I can use these spells whenever possible, I'm gonna use them. I also think maybe intelligence makes it a little bit longer, <laughs> ladies. I did go to college. I do have an over-the-head boulder holder. Well, that was a good dodge. No, 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 no. We want... We want this. Thank you for the dodge again. Uh, apparently, also, the shockwave doesn't go up. I'm starting to realize that this shockwave is not... Maybe not as great as I uh, was hoping it would be. Okay, well, we lived, and he didn't stomp on my head. Holy crap, that was dumb. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. How does this work? So it can go down, but it can't go up. But I think it can go up one block, but I guess it can't go up two blocks. That was, that was incredibly dangerous, but we lived. Like, let me, let me see here. If I shock, because yeah, it went up this one, right? Yeah, okay, so it can go up one block, but not two blocks. Good to know, good to know, good to know, good to know, good to know. Increases your speed. 
Lowers resist. No thank you. No thank you. Death protection. Oof. 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 Gotta equip it. Finally, armor. Lightning resist, strength, intelligence. I'll take it. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Do you have anything that we don't want? I've identified, right? Let's identify all these dang scrolls. Scroll of jump. Well, if I need another one. We haven't fought the, the boss yet, have we? There, and of course, whenever I get one of those shrines, I can't actually take advantage of it because I'm freaking wounded. I wasn't full health before the uh, before this floor happened. Well, that wasn't very effective. Oh, right, right, right. We gotta move. Oh God. We gotta figure out how we're gonna do this. My dude is actually like pretty tough sometimes. Yeah, I, I I feel like I don't have a very good build for him at all, actually. I I can't. I'm using the wrong spells potentially, but. Like, okay, I guess we'll just fire off some magic missiles constantly. I mean, it really does interfere with his ability to actually, like, get them going, but I'm not really, like, doing anything. Thank you. Thank you, by the way. You can't really aim the magic missiles either. Like, they just, they, they target what they target. That was a good miss. That works. You gotta run. Like, if you get him on a lower level from you, seems like maybe you can actually get some decent damage done. Why did you go for that one? That's what I wanna know. Come on. Okay, that was a very, very annoying fight. This guy, he he can be frustrating because you can't really, like he, he summons infinite body shields. You can't really get close to him sometimes. It's hard to hit. We got him. So we've got the key. I guess, um, oh god. I mean, shock, here's the thing, shockwave does do a lot of damage. Hard to hit with, but that's kind of the whole point, isn't it? Hello, shopkeep. Luckily, you didn't get pissed off at me. It's a better boulder protection, but I don't think we need it. Swim like a fish, maybe. Mmm, you know. We need it. Oh, but it's got poison resist on it, though. Hold on, what's our poison resist right now? Zero. Oh my god. Okay. Well, maybe we'll just, you know, try not to get hit by the poison. I mean, we've got a lot of, a lot of range damage, right? Hey, come here. Hey, come here. So how much are we healing by right now? Enough.
protection, swim like a fish underwater. What's our current hat? Boulder protection, right? Oh no, I didn't have it equipped. <laughs> Still. Our current hat is uh, just plus one int. Surely we should upgrade the hat, right? I assume a mask is a hat. It's all of my money though, man. We get poison next level though, I'm gonna be very salty, but I'll use a regen when we get down there, I think. Because our health is health is not looking fantastic. Oop, another scroll. What is this? Enchant. I would very much, I think, like to enchant the uh I don't remember. <laughs> I think I already got rid of the item that I was like, we're gonna keep this one forever. I guess let's save that for like a, a better weapon in the future to come around. All right, I think we are ready to go though. It's a really nice hat though. It's a pretty okay hat. Although, you know, I am wall phasing, so in my head I am also like, okay, what if we just rob the shop? It's kind of hard to do. Like, can I, uh... I can't jump out of the, out of the wall. Like, I can't go up, so I can't go through the ground under the shop and then jump up. Um... If I had floor phasing, I think maybe I could do that. You sell floor phasing boots? No. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let him keep his stock right now. Of course, now you gotta wonder why I'm do even doing it like that. I mean, yoink! Go through the wall. Can you come with me? <laughs> well, that's a little weird. I'm quite fast, which I like. Okay, good heal. Didn't use my animal stomp at all. Gotta love that. Uh, I feel like we would like either an alchemy combination or, I mean, if we save for stronger effects, we can get stronger regens. Uh, but I think, uh, I think archery would be pretty good now. Holy can give us one-ups, but Archery, bouncing arrows, we can be a lot more sustainable with the uh, the bows that we have. Let's take archery. At least now I can uh, strafe and jump. And we have death protection too. Surely that's <laughs> surely that's enough. Wait, 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 wait. Thank you. I think potions heal for 30. So I don't really want to use one right now. I want to use it later. I mean, I can stun lock them, which is very nice. Okay, I, uh, I don't take fall damage, which is nice. You know what? Dude, how many magic mappings do we have? Only two. All right, in that case, I'm not gonna use one. But I kind of wanna use one. Just to see where I'm going, but the boss is right here. I can already hear him. I can hear... I can see where he's spitting poison. Good. Remember to hover over the potion. I am already there. I'm actually going to eat the rat for 10 health, and then we're going to start shockwaving. 
That doesn't do it. Okay. All that tells me is that I don't know where the boss is. He's up here somewhere. Oh my lord! Okay. Wait for him to go down. We're in a bit of a... Bit of an awkward position here, me and him. You know? He's, 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 he's scared, that's what it is. He's just scared. He's not scared! Needed that. Oh, you bastard. He's right there. I need the regen. Oh my god. Oh god. The freaking arrows. I can't stand here. I gotta move. Oh my god, I'm gonna freaking I'm I'm like actually dead. I'm, I'm dead. We got death protection, we got death protection. Holy, I, I don't think I have seen like this bad of luck with this. I, 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 I actually just can't get away from the enemies fast enough. Okay, holy crap. Like, from the boss spawning in the first hallway, these damn flame traps, no resistances to anything. He's almost dead, the boss, so we can, we can kill him pretty quickly now. I'm out of heals, completely out. Could probably get him with the lightning. That arrow trap just shooting down the hallway repeatedly. It's still shooting, by the way. Wait for it to go. I mean... I'm not le oh, I'm not leaving without the rune. I would rather die. We missed or hit missed. I died. Okay. I I I have to admit though, I don't think I've seen that bad of luck with like the level generation and there's something up with the boss. He, he's just like glitching out in the corner and not actually moving. So, I I have to I have to call a little bit of BS on that. If the boss's AI was working correctly, he would chase me down and then I wouldn't have this freaking hallway with an arrow trap trying to kill me. I am I'm, I'm a little peeved. <laughs> but that was fun though. And I really liked starting with 10 intelligence. I love the um I loved the uh the high int mage build. I don't think I've seen intelligence that high. So what killed me? Let's see. What killed me was a swinging axe. You could say it was the boss, you could say it was the swinging axe. I'll leave it to you to decide what was the cause of death there. But I wanted that damn rune. That's okay though. <laughs> For now, for those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, subscribe for more, check me out on Twitch for when I go live, support the channel at any of the links below in the video description, and I hope to see you here again for the next run of Vagante.